morning, PHS. I'm Jeffrey. And I'm Elvin. Today is Thursday, November 17th, and a day two on your schedule. One of the national holidays that fall on today's date is National Butter Day. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Boys basketball tryouts will be held on November 21st, 22nd, and 23rd after school, regardless of a full or half day. All physicals must be handed in and cleared by the nurse in order to try out. Tryouts for girls basketball will be held on November 21st, 22nd, and 23rd as well. Physicals must be completed and cleared by the school doctor prior to tryouts. Times are posted on Google Classroom. Please see Coach Fulmer in room 222 if you have any questions or need the classroom code. Ski Club is back. Anyone interested in joining Ski Club this year, please join the Google Classroom using code U2MZ3YT or see Mr. Brandis in room 205. All paperwork is posted on the classroom and must be completed by November 18th. The first 45 students will secure a spot for our club. Trips begin Wednesday, January 4th. Hope to see you on the slopes. The next book club meeting will be 1117 in room 109 during activity period. All newcomers are welcomed. Huge exciting news to share. The Phillipsburg Wrestling Line Club will be starring in all girls Girls Only Wrestling Club for the 22-23 season. This brings so much opportunity to females interested in learning the sport of wrestling and ultimately competing. Initial focus will be on learning the sport as well as technique. There will be a brief interest meeting held on Friday, November 18th during activity period with Mr. Longacre and Coach Kisselbach, room 252. Any girls interested are encouraged to attend this meeting to learn more about what the program could offer you. It's also an opportunity to ask questions and see if the sport of wrestling might be the right fit for you, your future. The next senior class fundraiser is a penny ward during all lunches starting Monday, November 14th through Tuesday, November 22nd. Buckets with teachers' names will be stationed outside the cafeteria. The participating teachers are Mrs. Kane, Mr. Brandis, Mrs. Bronico, and M Mrs. Merrick and Mr. Sigafus. The teacher with the most money in their bucket by the end of lunches on Tuesday the 22nd will be forced to wear Easton attire during the entire school day and pep rally on Wednesday the 23rd. Pennies raise money, paper money, nickels, dimes, quarters, half dollars, and gold one dollar coins decrease the money. Who do you want to see wearing red and black Rover attire? That's all we have today. Let's hand it to Demit with the weather. Good morning, PHS. I'm Dylan. Today's weather will be partly cloudy with a high of 46 and a low of 33. Let's hand it back over to the anchors. Today, Peberg, we have some PHS news about Environmental Club to share with you. Please stay tuned to watch. My name is Tommy. Who am I here with today? Mr. Josephson. Mr. J, what is one thing? Mr. Josephson. No, my no, apologies, Mr. Sir. Mr. J, get jiggular. What is one thing you do to help the environment? Oh, you got a compost. You understand? You, you can get eggshells. Uh, if you're using eggs, if you've got an egg heavy diet, you take those eggshells, put them right back into the soil. It brings calcium to uh, beautiful plants then in the spring. How about the banana pills, too? Come on, let's not even start on those banana peels. But, but those are good. All right, well, thank you for your time. Absolutely. Good morning, my name's Tommy. Who am I here with today? Uh, Mr. Viscomi. Mr. Viscomi, what is one thing you do to help out the environment? One thing I do to help out the environment is I clean up litter. I hate seeing garbage on the ground. So a lot of times if I'm walking, I'll just pick it up, find the closest garbage can, and throw it in. So clean up litter. Excellent answer. Thank you for your time. Thank you. My name is Tommy. Who am I here with today? Mr. Compton. All right, Mr. Compton, what is one thing that you do to help out the environment? Uh, one thing I'd like to do is just try to make use of all the materials I already have. So uh, if I have old clothes, either try to recycle them or just kind of reuse them for other things. Turn them into rags, wear them for, you know, 
bedtime clothes or pajamas or anything like that. Um, try not to waste any of the stuff I already have and make use of it to the best of my ability. Great answer, Mr. Compton. Thank you. Of course, thank you. Good morning, Peabook student and staff. My name is Anthony, and did you know that over 400 families in Peabook do not have enough food to eat for Thanksgiving? We hope you can bring in a box of mashed potatoes, pasta, stuffing, rice, corn, even a turkey if you're able. Any food item that you can bring in would be a big help to these families. Please place your donations in the boxes located in front of the school or outside of the guidance by Friday, November 18th. Thank you for your help. This is all we have for you today, Peabird. Thank you for watching today's State Line and TV show. Have a fantastic day.